it's the most beautiful sunny day and I'm sick. I have like a sore throat. I'm staying home from uni. I'm gonna go buy some immune boosting and like pity snacks <laughs> for myself. I have a sore throat. It's not that dramatic. I just didn't want to get anyone else sick and also I am supposed to be resting to take care of myself so I can't go out and frolic in the sunlight although I really want to. <laughs> I got this mirror for my birthday. workout yesterday and so the soreness of my body today feels like I'm sick so I'm trying to separate the dif different sensations in my body right now I'd forgotten the scarf. I wore it all of last winter and then it hasn't been scarf season and then I saw a picture of me wearing it and I was like I need to wear that again <laughs> now that it's cold. It's like this kind of scratchy wool knitted like rib style. grocery haul. Okay, first off, I went to a thrift store and I found this. Uh, for keeping water cold in the fridge. And I thought it would be a nicer way to have a lot of water cold from the fridge than our current soda stream of bottle. And the lady in the store gave me a discount on this. She was so nice. She was like, no, you need to pay less for that. I was like, okay. So that was a little detour, but I started out there. And then salad. These like crackers, puffed corn things. Popcorn. It's been forever since I had popcorn, I realized. So, of course yet. For dinner, I got two of those. Got some beets for juice and dinners. I got two cucumbers because I love to snack on cucumbers and I need to stay hydrated today, I think. I have like a really dry feeling in my throat. And so, of course, when you're sick, you need orange juice, right? Is that just orange juice propaganda? Maybe. We were running low on my favorite tea blend, so uh, that can't happen. We can't run out. So I've got some new. And oh, the other courgette. And a cauliflower. I like cauliflower both like 
baked, grilled on a pan, uh, steamed with butter in the oven, in soups. She's versatile. And then I love it with these because these leaves are perfect for my guinea pigs. So, yeah. Mission accomplished. Look at that! in here while I relax and get better. sunshine being in the bedroom instead of the living room because this is the side that gets the sun so I'm moving in here now <laughs> that was really silly just came back from another little run. I bought candles. These are brown. And this echinacea syrup. I've only tried them as like a tincture that you drink in the water. I'm so tired. The sun also kind of went away. I love buying my candles secondhand. <laughs> They're all tied together. They also had tea lights. I thought, why not? I use tea lights for uh, my essential oil diffusers. So I'm actually running through quite a lot of them. I've never been a fan of tea lights before that point, really. I've always been more into candles, but... I think some of these have scent themselves. Smells perfumey. We'll see. But I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a serving of this.
I knitted a pair of slippers for Thomas, who is a size 47. So they're ridiculously big because, you know, they're going to be felted, so they're going to shrink. But right now they're just for giants. I think it's hilarious. His and hers. I added some extra rows to make it more high and less ballerina-like. Yeah. Thursday, I have an early class. I have to get up at 7 today. It is 7. Um, but then we're gonna go play Batman. Is that how you say it? Badminton? Badminton? Which I'm excited about. Okay, we're gonna do a quick sidestep chronologically here and go back to October 7th where I went on a canoe trip with Lagerbjörn. Their mom has a canoe that we got to borrow. The weather was Perfect, honestly. I haven't canoed in so long, but it was really, really fun. Uh, we brought snacks, of course, tea. Uh, I found this lovely vegan cheese that I brought, and Thomas had baked this wonderful loaf of bread with uh, nettle powder in it. A lot of the month of October was really rainy and dark and cold, but on this day, it was just magically the perfect weather for a canoe trip. Due to all of the earlier rain in the month, the creek that we were sailing on was like overflowing. Lagabian and I have been friends for nine, going on ten years next year. And they are like a sibling to me and we always have these great adventures. And this was definitely one of them. I didn't put it into my October video because there was like too much of footage. Uh, I wanted to dedicate some more space for it, so I'm gonna do that now. I hope you enjoy. Mm. <laughs> 
Ik net net zo Ja, je hebt er zo pijn. Det er jeg ikke på. Vi kunne godt bare sejle ind i dem. Det sjovt. Det er mig, der sidder på os. Nå ja. Så skal vi lige vende om. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Hvad er der imod lys? Jeg kan ikke tage Mm-hmm. 